So here's the website we designed for Barako World Studio. It's a beautiful studio located in Lake Lagos, Nigeria. Yeah, if you visit the website for the first time, you'll see quite a number of pop-on. By the right, you have the pop-up for the cookies consent. This is a mandatory by the GDPR law. So if the audience accepts this, it goes off and gives them the opportunity to see stuff like videos, audios, or whatever that is going. And by the side, the pop-up from the live chat will notify customers that they are available for a live chat now the beautiful thing about this particular pop-up as you can see here is that when any message is sent to the customer barracus team receives it from the back end so if i say i a chat will come up and you can see i can hear that notification so for barracus work studio if they want to see the back end of it they just need to type on their browser and log into it say live chat for barracus work studio Show I sound now. So yes, here's the customer sending a message. You can see you can decide to join the chat. We can also use the chat to collect leads. Now, what I just want to show you about the chat is that if the customer tries to say anything and he has not even entered send, you can see that from the live chat, you can see it even without him typing or hitting the button send. You can also whisper to the team member. So Barocus Studio from the back end can actually respond to chat. They can save you. You can use this for a complete customer service team because you can save tickets, you can collect leads, you can do shortcuts or such that you put short messages so you don't have to keep typing all the time now outside from the this thing the live chat also has what is called the monitoring so you can see who is live on the site even without the person conversating with you was ideal um for barrel team not to always chat the customer until when the customer chats them back so now you can see this is beautiful from the home you can also see real time um visit to how many people are live on the website i'm live on the website here documentations can be kept and different stuff so now if you look at this um website up above here you see that we have something called allow now if the user clicks on that there's a pop-up this thing that says allow push notification now for every customer that allows that push notification we can send periodic messages to them so they get it on their pc whether or not they're on the website so by this side there will be a push um, notification where you see you are subscribed to the push notification a message will be here that will make customers get the push notification so here's the menu navigation that shows talent on barco works to you this barco works take them to the youtube it takes it directly to the YouTube page for Baroku Work Studio. So we've created that for Baroku Work Studio already. Now you can see the book section. But before I go into the book section, you can see call to action, social media, and what have you. So let me just show you an highlight of Baroku Work Studio. So you can see written blog articles that are well designed for Baroku Studio. So they have either to book and for the talent on show. So they can come here to just click for the talent on show. And then you can see so let's just quickly look at the about us before we go to book so you can see the about us you can see how wonderful this is you can see our services so you can see our service you can see how beautiful this is like i said media talent or the book section you can check out the blog so you can see blog story and by the side people can search through the website by the side people can go through the instagram and see what's up and then the last one which is the contact us so you can see the contact us page so i'm going to be testing all of this um should i say form or booking region so now we start from the contact us page so as you mean i'm a custom man i type at the bio motor show i put my number and then this is the message i can send so now thank you for contacting us we will be in touch with you we see new entry from the contact form you can see i can get it now this is by testing the video you can see how sweet and lovely that is let's quickly go to the talent on form this is the talent on form when a user clicks on the talent on form they have to fill out their information so i'm just going to do that so you can see now when i fill out this information it's going to be taking me to the next party up you will see how the navigation shows so now we ask for their social media and so for example they already put an example for example instagram this and so for me i'll just say am i male or female that i can just choose to upload any picture of myself because this is an example i'll just select just any picture as as a sample i choose my date of birth say september so you can see i'm on finish and i click on finish and then submit you can see 
that successfully submitted and then what it does it redirects me to where they can pay so this payment can be changed anytime so just for confirmation the um, customer can actually put this each of our information one six you see the amount is already but we can change the amount anytime and then it redirects the customer to where they can use their card payments they can use their bank they can use transfer or ussd to trans to make transactions so if they use CSSD, it's going to bring out the gt pop-up so now you can see this is open to any type of business so that's for the talent on so let's just go back to baroque work studio so here's an email for the customer the customer that just filled in the entry should you see they also get an email for that that shows that this is the picture they added as their passport so they have a copy to be sure that they send the right picture to you so now if you go to Baraku work studio email you find that Baraku work studio also received an email for it so when you go back there you say new entry for talent on wherever so now you can see the name you have a new website is in the name of the person and the information the person put and then the picture is attached to it you can see how beautiful this is also here we are back to um the website for baroque world studio so now let's try the booking section so here we are already on the booking page now so you can see now the place where we have category the customer selects live band station let's assume they both live band is recording so the customer selects the live band as an option so and there's also where we what we are call services so it's four hours live band services so you can see now this session is best designed for music live band require who request blah 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 so it's in the morning section morning section starts by nine afternoon section depending on time that we've set for it so let's just select morning section as an example for this um this thing now am i available or not before now the customer can then tell us when he or she is available so this booking system automatically calculates and shows him dates depending on his or her availability so the customer can check fifth of this thing the customer can decide to say oh on tuesdays i will not be available on this i will not be available the same way you can have a conversation with customers so now you see i'll be available from 9 a.m to this thing. so it's automatically streamline and filter this thing for the customer but let's just leave it at 9 a.m to this thing and then move to next you can see it shows all the available time remember this is was selected just for money so you see below you can find a list of available times so for four hours live band session by money section so you can see that shown by money section so let's assume this customer selects sunday in the morning you will see that um there's a place to enter the name so the customer enters his own name this is where the customer adds any kind of information additional information if he wants us to know so when you click on next you can see what happens it says that enter the verification code from the email so i will go to the email i will then enter the verification code however for marketing sake and convenience we might remove this but the only reason why we put this particular confirmation is just because of some customers might decide to put a wrong email address and it's difficult to reach out to the customer so the customer entered this code as can seen from the email and then click on verify so he's going to take us to the next page now you can see now he says that your number this is already associated with another email phone name please update it so you can say update so it's going to take out the information that is there so that happened because i previously have registered with that number so but it's usually not going to happen so you can see that's proceeded to check out so now on the checkout page the same amount of the print this thing four hours live bar session is in. if there's any coupon from the back end that's the team baracolo studio can actually add coupon code that gives this person a discount but for now there is no so let's just proceed to check out so it enters my information at the bio motor show address still remains the same number still remains the same and then i can decide to use direct bank transfer if i decide to do the online um payment it's going to bring out the pop-up just the same way i explained to you the same way it is so whereby the um user can decide to pay with their bank card ussd or whatever you can see beneath it it shows an highlight and then the pop-up appears and they pay with your bank card or whatever and you get it directly into baraku studios account but because we are not going to use this we are going to go back to that same checkout and select the bank direct bank transfer so once you place this order it goes directly you can see now it says that thank you for your order your order has been received our bank so they can now send their money to this our bank account you can see how this looks and how this is beautiful so if you go to the customer's email 
what are you going to be seeing there are a lot of emails you're going to see so you see one that says that this is a confirmation that you have booked for hours live action we are waiting you at um blah 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 thank you for using our choosing our company so you can see how this is the confirmation that blah 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 so they already received that this is an invoice that says that you should pay now say thanks your order has been it's on hold until we confirm that payment has been received so our bank details is this they can also see a receipt of transaction for what they've done so now if we go to the back end for baroku studio so you see from our back end we can see that the order which is and still on hold because we've not confirmed assuming the customer pays us this money and we confirm the payment we then change it on hold to completed now just check it out so you can see by this side you can just change it to on hold to completed so before I click this update, mm -hmm. I want you to know that you mm -hmm. would have received an email as the Barco Studio would have received an email confirming new booking information, the time at which the person is calling the client's email and number. You would have also received the invoice that says that this person has made an order, but the other is yet to be saying you see the following order, blah 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 drop the information with your own copy so now that's not all so let's just go back to this thing now so now we are going to be changing this to completed you see that it will now update the customer with another email that this transaction has been completed so now let's go back to customer's account so it says your baroku watch studio order is now complete you can see now you can answer we are finished processing your order and they also get there this thing thank you so that's about it so when you go back to the home you find out that everything about this website is beautiful is responsive you can communicate with the customer you can see the website is responsive you can, it can fit into any size so as you drag it you can see where the menu button changes you can see all of these things is now in a tab format and tab screen size when you switch it over you can see all of them takes each row now you can see the menu now changes to this you can see all of that you can see it's mobile responsive you can drag it to um, tablet size it can fit into any screen size you have your contact information here and all of the information you need to do and also you have like a mobile app for it thank you For the sake of accountability, I will just be showing you so some of the others that we may test orders that we may just click um, on customers. You see your customers' payment orders here, their contact details and what of you. So you can see their contact details. You can see some of their information, how much they made, the orders they made. You can check of all the orders there now. For the booking um, entry, you go directly to Bookly. So Bookly is a paid um, application that we put in added it to the website so you can see the calendar night that's scheduled for different calendar saying that um, you have two appointments on your calendar these are test orders that we need so you can check for morning session okay you can see for the month now you can see that on sunday there's already an order by this i did buy orders if you go throughout the month you can see whatever order has been approved that has been scheduled there so you can then go check just under the book you can then check for the customers of those things so you just click on customize so you can see the two orders that have been made and confirmed so you can see the customer information you can edit these orders now to show more accountability you can see that we have premium plugin for what fans is a premium plugin you have um for your seo rank math you also have a premium plugin for rank math gen stands and rank math pro that's for um the blog plugin you have um premium plugin for elementor now this is what makes it easy for your team to manage so you can see that these applications are all bought and then fully updated 